What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today I wanted to give you guys a quick heads up because there is a new system software update 3.15 and every time there's a new system software update for the PlayStation 4 you guys always ask me what is included with the patch notes, what is this new system software update supposed to do? And I wanted to go over that with you guys really quickly. As you guys are seeing on the screen, PlayStation has confirmed the PlayStation 4 software update 3.15 is coming tonight um, as I'm making this video. It's a minor update designed to improve system performance. Now, my boy over on Twitter, Tux, um, actually tweeted out 7th Core Unlocked hashtag PlayStation 4. I will link his Twitter in the video description make sure to go check him out follow him him if you haven't already he's an awesome dude and he does um cover a lot of stuff over on twitter um so big shout out to him thank you for that information so if in case you guys are wondering what this means seventh core unlocked the playstation 4 has an eight core processor the previous updates that we've received unlock the six uh, core and now with this update it's going to unlock the seventh core what does that mean for us what does that mean for us PlayStation gamers really nothing to be completely honest with you it doesn't affect us at all what it does is it helps developers it's gonna help developers in the long run to be able to create better and more awesome games um, Allowing developers access to the seventh core it will speed up processing and uh, a whole bunch of other things. So, uh, again, big shout out to Tux. Uh, follow him on Twitter if you guys haven't already. Um, he's a pretty cool dude too. Um, he he does different things on Twitter, so make sure you check him out. Um, as far as the rest of the system software update, it's just going to include stability issues. Um, as many of you guys know, we just had an outage for the PlayStation 4. And a lot of PlayStation fans that have seen outages happen, we always get an updated software um, update right after we get a PlayStation outage to improve system software stability, stability issues. And that is going to be addressed in this patch as well. Definitely let me know what you guys think about this in the comments section below. Your feedback is always important. Make sure to hit a like. That really helps me out. If you guys haven't already subscribed, I keep you guys up to date on all of the latest PlayStation 4, PlayStation Plus, news, updates, all that good stuff so you don't have to. Anyways, I will see you guys in the next news update. You guys are freaking awesome as always.